Hi guys, I'm just here to do a quick video for you. I'm actually on lunch from work. I came home because I wanted to see my shoes. I uh, just got these in. I got one pair in yesterday and two today, and I have another pair coming, but I'm not going to do this today, obviously, because I'm not going to be here till Thursday. But uh, these are my shoes I got in the Soul Struck sale haul, and I just want to show you guys. I'm really broke now after this, though, so uh, I'm not eating. I haven't, like, bought any food in, like, five days. <laughs> I've just been living off of like scraps and whatever my mom and dad can like provide for me. But I usually go over to my dad's for dinner lately anyway, so it's cool. But yeah, who needs food when you have shoes, right? Anyway, the first pair I'm going to show you guys, I was so excited to get these. I just pulled them out of the box and tried them on. These are the Unif Hellraisers in black on black. As you can see, they came in their little uh, Unif box, the little dust bags. And uh, they have like padding in them so the spikes don't get wrecked. And the shoes don't get wrecked from the spikes, I mean. But yeah, these are, uh, I was kind of worried because on the site, the pictures almost looked like, the leather looked weird. It looked, didn't look like the leather in the other pictures of shoes, so I thought it would be that crappy suede leather. But these are genuine leather, you can tell. They're really nice looking. Uh, I like the black on black, actually, I think better than the black on silver, just because, I don't know, it's all black. It's cool. But, uh... I don't know, these are really comfortable, they're really nice. I like these a lot. I usually don't spend a lot of money on flats, like I said, but these are like a really, this is one of the first pairs of really nice expensive flats I ever bought. Probably the first pair of nice expensive flats I've ever bought. They're a little loose in the heel, but they, they're like tight in the toe, it's weird. Like they're an 8 and I'm a true 8, so I mean I'm assuming they're going to fit better once I wear them more. But once you, when you wear them without socks, they kind of suction to your feet, so it's not that big of an issue. I might get heel grips, I'm not sure. But yeah, I really like these a lot. They're really cool. And, yes, I'm a big fan. If you're looking into these, I would recommend them. I've wanted these forever, and Soulstruck had them on sale for a power hour for, like, $111. I know that's a lot, but they're normally $165, so I was like, cool, 50 bucks off. I went for it, and I'm really glad I did because I kept putting those off because they never go on sale, so I was like, oh, I don't want to spend that much on flats, so I'm, I'm glad I got them. That's all i got to say. Um, this next pair is really freaking cool. Uh, these are the Jeffrey Campbell Cleta in uh, black iridescent. As you can see, they still have the paper in them, so that's actually the paper stuffing. But they have uh, a clear iridescent center portion made out of like plastic. I don't know, those are pretty interesting. Um, depending on what color socks you wear, the uh, shoe will change color. I really think these are freaking beautiful shoes. And I am so excited to wear them. And just like the different possibilities with socks, I could wear a pattern sock, I could wear a purple sock, a black sock, green sock, and it would alter the color, you know what I mean? So I don't know, so these are awesome. Just like look at that, it's color changing. See all the rainbow colors? In real life it looks like blue, and there's you can see purple, you can see yellow, teal, all sorts of colors. It's really nice looking. I don't know, these are awesome. And like from the front they just look like a plain Lita. You know, and then you see them from the side. And I love the black heel, too. I always like when the heel's black. I'm not really a huge fan of the wood heel on the Leos. It's one of those things I don't like about the shoe. Anyway, that's my second pair. And, um... My third pair is another cool one. I've wanted these for a while, and they were on sale, so I figured I'd buy them. These are the Back Offs in Black Snake. It kind of sucks that I wanted them in the original black leather, but they weren't on sale, so I was like, I'll just get the Black Snake. Well... Like, six hours later, they put the regular black leather on sale for the same price these were. I was like, damn it. So, whatever. I don't know. At least they're still black, I guess. But I really like these. Um, they're, uh, they have a little bit of a shine to them because of the snake finish. As you can see, the snake skin look to them. I don't know. They're, the snake skin, it's pretty obvious, but it's not, like, horribly obvious from far away. It more just looks like a shiny leather or something. And, as you can see, they have the shiny silver leather strip along the bottom. I don't know, I like these a lot. They're really, uh, like, futuristic combat boots. I don't know. But they're really comfortable. They're, like, a 5-inch heel and a 2-inch platform, I believe. And it seriously feels like you're wearing flats. So those are awesome if you want to check those out. Uh, it's a back-off boot and black snake. And I'm going to, I guess, walk in these really quick to show you guys. These are the black Unipel razors.
These are the Cleta and Black Iridescent. As you can see, they uh, this is just with a bare foot. They change color in the light. Really cool. I don't know, I like these a lot. I probably will, I don't know, I'll probably wear socks with them. I don't know if I like, I like the barefoot too, but I think the socks will add more color to it. But this has a lot of interesting colors too. I think with a black sock, it would definitely be more uh, intense of a color versus coming off as like sheer with the color change. Either way, it's freaking cool looking. They have little uh, ventilation holes on the inside of the plastic for your feet to get air, I suppose, so they don't get all sweaty. That's kind of interesting. And I don't know, it's just really cool to kind of see where your foot sits in a normal Lita because it's cut the same, but the clear part in the middle lets you see where your foot is. So These are pretty uh, awesome. I really like these. Look how cool! Woohoo! Yeah, I really like these. These are the back offs in black snake silver. As you can see, uh, you can wear them laced up all the way or kind of undone. I left these undone a little bit because I kind of like how that looks. Uh, these, like I said, are super easy to walk in. They're like surprise. Like it's shocking how weird, how flat they feel. They feel like flat. I'm not even kidding. You're like, I do not feel like I'm wearing heels in these at all. Of course, they make me a lot taller, but other than that, not really at all. But yeah, I really like these, as you can see. They have that silver shininess. They look really cool. They're like, I like that they're a more uh, casual looking shoe versus like a really dressy one. So you could kind of wear these as like an everyday shoe when you wouldn't have any issues. But yeah, I really like these. Pretty cool looking shoes. So yeah, those were the shoes I bought in Soul Strokes recent big sale. They had 40% off all sale items. And uh, I got 30% off a few of the other I got 30% off the back offs and the Hellraisers and 40% off the Cletus. So, yes, um, <laughs> I don't know. Uh, yeah, that's all I gotta say, I guess. I bought more shoes that I didn't need. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching. Thank you for, scribe for subscribing. I will keep making the videos if you keep watching them. I will talk to you guys later. Thank you. Bye.